as an entrepreneur, always accept responsibility for everything that's happening in your business. Either because you have caused it yourself and you have to take the responsibility for what, what happened and what you have to do now, or if it was an external event, also take the responsibility for the actions that now have to be taken to correct the situation or to find a solution. You are always responsible for everything that happens in your business. Hey, my name is Armin L. Rao. I'm the founder of A. Leonard Rao, the entrepreneur's entrepreneur, and I'd like to help you to become a great leader. I've been a leader, coach, and entrepreneur for more than 20 years, and uh, now I'm sharing my experience with entrepreneurs worldwide to enable them to become better leaders. If you don't want to miss any of my content, please feel free to subscribe to this channel by clicking on the red button below the video. Now, what does responsibility actually mean? It means that you don't blame others, you don't make excuses, and you don't give up. So what does that mean now? How can we assume responsibility? Now, here's three things for you. Principle number one to take responsibility. Introduce corrective action. That is extremely important. So you are in a situation, something went pear-shaped or something happened to you or the team made a mistake. Now analyze the situation, go into the causes and be really rigorous in addressing it and correcting it. And if you have maybe hurt somebody in you know, the heat of uh, the business, be strong and be strong enough to apologize. The second uh, important principle to take responsibility is root cause analysis. So the problem is there and you, in order to find the initial cause, you are going to ask a question of uh, a series of whys until you have finally found the root cause. So you say why until there's no more answer. Once you've done that, you make an action plan together with your team and you follow up these actions and control that they are implemented. So principle number two, find the root cause. And the third and final principle I'd like to share with you on how you can also take responsibility is just to, as I say, tick the box and get on with it. No, there's no point in holding grudges against yourself. Everybody makes make silly mistakes. So do I, everybody does. And just tick it off and get on with it. Here's a, a, a trick that I use, you know, to uh, stop, you know, getting mad at myself. I just see the situation in front of me or the mistake that happened and I see it in my, in my mind and then in my mind I actually tick the box. Sometimes I, clo I close the eyes and do this tick and then I shift it to the left and it's gone. It's quite a nice trick to get rid of it and then you can get on with it. Now everybody in business must take responsibility and you as the leader of the business business you are unbelievably obliged to take this responsibility in order to do that you have to find the root causes of problems for example you don't have to give up you 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 you, you must really not uh, hold any grudges against yourself and also accept you know that once something happened you know you have to get on with it the life Coaching actually teaches you these and many other skills within weeks, the skills of world-class leaders. I'm going to share all this experience with you. If you have a similar problem with responsibility or you are sometimes overwhelmed or you procrastinate maybe in certain situations, feel free to write me a WhatsApp right now. The number is on the screen and we can have a chat about it. I would be happy to exchange uh, our points of view. So this was Armin Rao from Armin L. Rao, the entrepreneur's entrepreneur. Thanks for having me. I am really happy to share all that with you and see you next time. Don't forget, lead yourself.